Hey everybody, they say the devil is in the details, so let's go over the details about the new demonic show, Pauline. I know one of the biggest tactics of the evil one is to make you think that he does not even exist, but he does. And when he gets you to think that way, that he's not even real, he's just a little red character in movies or shows, then he can do something so blatant like this and it'll just go right over your head. Firstly, let's get into the show just a little bit, and then I'm going to add some clips of um, Billy Hallowell's podcast that he did about this. Okay, so here's what Pauline is about, and I'm going to credit the article in the comment section. Disney has announced a new German original series for Disney Plus. Not really a shock, right, with Disney? called Pauline, which is about an 18-year-old teenager who accidentally becomes pregnant from a one-night stand with school stress, the climate crisis, and the downfall of society weighing heavily on her mind. Something she doesn't need at all right now is catching feelings, especially not for her one-night stand, Lucas, who, as it turns out, is the devil himself. Note that Pauline's situation, her environment, is turbulent, vulnerable, weak. What a great way for the enemy to come in there school issues, stress in the world. Sounds familiar, doesn't it? She's not the only 18 year old going through things like that. I'm sounding the alarm on this because there are so many people so deceived that think the devil just isn't real, that are spiritually ignorant, and then he's going bold and doing these things. And when you tango with anything demonic, you are gonna suffer demonic oppression and be led away from God. Mark and avoid anything that looks like the devil because odds are it is. Check out this clip from the podcast. This particular show is called Pauline and it's a German show. We don't know a whole lot about it, but we do know that the synopsis is that it's about an 18 year old girl who falls in love with Satan um, or has a one night stand with Satan. What was your reaction when you first heard about this series? Well, I mean, my reaction was Satan always comes masquerading as an angel of light. And so he's going to portray himself in the form that people are most readily able to accept because he wants to appeal to the masses. And we're seeing this over and over and over again. You would think that programming like this would stop working on people. But in fact, there is an audience for it, which is why creators continue to make it.